Hi guys, we're back with the tiny puppy school. I'm going to put some effects going here. Oh, here, here's something new. I got some McDonald's. <laughs> Okay, that was just a little intro with the Christmas music. Anyway, I've improved my lighting mic just by using this flashlight and a camping light because I liked the way that video looked with the better lighting. You know, I, we're creating a whole genre here. I need to get out there and crank out some content, get this Black Shepherd spinning and doing whatever it does, bending like Beckham, or find an American soccer player. Just as an insult to these people, since David Beckham moved away. Yeah, no, he's out. If you're in the UK, you're not bending on like Beckham. This expat's living in LA in a mansion, so forget about him. We'll find out who the best American soccer player is. And you will then bend them like that person. Like, get over yourself, lady. All right, so I, I do want to let them settle. And if you survive, just because I can't train all of them at once. But I've got not that organized of a situation. You know, you do want to have little trays and props and all that crap. You know, I understand that. If you said, why, if you're training for other handlers, these people need props. Anybody could fool me. If I was at a restaurant and they said, oh, would you like to meet the chef? Someone with a chef hat came out and shook my hand. Then went back over by the stove and was scooting around a spatula. I don't need to know anymore. This is the chef. You know. If he said, well, you're smarter than a dog. Not much. <laughs> All right, look, so this is what we've got. We've got the keys and it is only one key and the one key is a tiny key and I did put the ribbon on there, which I do on all the keys anyway. So I'm very quiet. I'm just letting it occur. Oh, look. Oh, he already sees it. See how when the other one comes over there, he put it right in my hand. Hey, Mom, you want to see it? Oh, that one saw the money. <laughs> you can let a beat it. <laughs> how cute of a video is this going to be? There's still one left. No, it's not easy when they're all crowding. I'm trying to get it. He said, do you want to play on that? I mean, somewhat. You just have to be careful that you're not one of the ones trying to fight for it. It's very, very, very important for people to make sure that the puppy or whatever sees it's... Oh, sorry, let me see. Hang on. You little peanut. Oh, you got it. Maybe you can see, I don't know, sometimes the shot looks tighter on the phone and then it's really, okay. I'm not eat really in it. It's very deliberate with the hands though, I mean. That's where I put the slow-mo. It's, it, it's, it is hard to see, I'm blind as a bat anyway. It's hard to see if they're picking it up. If he said, what are you looking for? 
Then just to lift the head up, which is, you said is what's the intention. I mean, the next step after that would be to probably start walking. <laughs> you know what I mean? Here you go, son, I picked it, uh, picked it up. Uh, you know, what other moves do they have? If you said backing up or forward, who knows? All right, so these are gonna be good because of the noise, watch. got to have commonalities. If you're training for other handlers, I, this is what I've come to understand, Mike. I mean, after assessing their skill level, they're able to actually sit there, I mean, and not move. I mean, that, that's, you know, most of them are, we can check that box off. If you say, what about walking? Until we're starting to get in some dicey area there. As far as walking along, I mean, just, we're getting dicey there. If you said, what about moving around? No, people like to plant themselves like a tree and grow roots. I've never seen anything like it. I've never seen such stationary handlers. They might be willing to take one step, but that's it. <laughs> you little peanuts. I, I need a couple of them to fall asleep. I'm trying to get all of them a chance, though. We're trying to give them all of them a chance. You, you saw what happened. I mean, he sort of heard it as an afterthought and then looked. Ooh, well, peanut. Oh. You little piece. Put it right in my head. I, I think you are looking for that paw thing, Mike. If you said, what is that? I think that's the precursor to I'm getting ready to eat. I'm getting ready to eat. If you said, what about with the ball? I mean, I, you know, that used to be the thing. They used to teach dogs to scratch and stuff if there was drugs. You know, that's, that's passe now. Nobody does that anymore. I don't think. I mean, it's all passive alert. But if you said it was pretty easy to teach them to scratch, yeah. All right, watch. I see that one looking at my eyes. I don't look back. I don't look back. People don't use indifference. They just want to go up to a dog. They want to say, I'm your friend. Dogs love me. Lubba, 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 lubba. Then that's it. It's over with. It's the one night stand. And then the dog won't come to them. Then they're going to try to get it over there until it sit nine times and say, see? It already knows how to sit. <laughs> Mike's like, I'll oh, get over yourself, lady. It's true. this paper down so it would be less convoluted and if you didn't have a tray Mike's like who doesn't have a tray lady <laughs> I am losing it Mike I am losing it <laughs> Mike's like what's new it's very exciting work though you know, and if people said well I'm really a citizen scientist and I've really studied dog behavior and I see what you're saying is right I'd say oh my god people you know they'll fight you tooth and nail if you say the slightest thing, I told this guy, this guy's some trainer in Brazil. He's a roll, full grown man, full grown man, looks like he's in his 40s, rolling around, can't keep his hands off this Malinois. It's giving him the shake off. 
I said, it's giving you the shake off. If he said, what did he, oh, he mocked me and put laughing emojis. And then I looked and watched it again. If he said, well, then I noticed it did it twice. My hand isn't even there though. My hand swoops in. <laughs> he put it right in my hand, Mike. <laughs> Mike's my loyal fan. I did, I mean, maybe I do test people. Mm -hmm. It's true though. If he said, well, I remember distinctly. I went on your page. I saw Todd from Redeeming Dogs. If he said you didn't look any further, no. No, I didn't, Mike. <laughs> I think you know now why. <laughs> I saw that guy. I said, no way, no way, no, I think I can be friends with this guy. It's just, it's, 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 it's too much. This, I see this Todd. He's so awful, just terrible. Just please tell me he went out of business and works at Starbucks. You know? Oh, please tell me he opened a successful Starbucks franchise. And let's dogs can go in the patio. All right, Mike said, okay, I, you got the keys, but what about a million dollars, lady? Can the puppy pick up a million dollar bill? Mike, I'm glad you asked that. No, here, here we go. Oh, I have a question for one of our viewers, Mike, in the UK. Uh, he bends them like Phil in the name soccer player. Uh, but he wants to know if the puppy can pick up a million dollars. So my answer is yes, Mike. There's no words. The treat denotes the end of the exercise, and I think you need to write that down for people. That's the only way the dog feels like it's in control. If it gets the treat, then there's, you know, other obligations that must be met. you do I mean it is probably harder for guys they have bigger hands I got in a fight with these people on Garmin some good old boys and I said this remote hasn't changed in 40 years if you said what did they say they say no need if it's perfectly in your hand <laughs> if you said what did I say oh lovely man hands <laughs> That was my response. <laughs> if you said, what did they respond? Angry, angry emojis. Oh, laughing. No, mocking me, mocking me. <laughs> mocking me. Oh, okay, yeah, let me get a fog machine in here. What about that? A fog machine, and then right when he's doing it, I have like someone in a monster costume bust through the door. How about that? If you said doing what? Just coming, th no, Mike, not just coming through, throwing cones and tennis balls and stuff against the wall while he does it. <laughs> he said that sounds staged. Mike, how many videos have you been watching where suddenly someone just comes bursting in? Come on. <laughs> oh, hi, Martha. Anyway, listen, I gotta get a video of this, so I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the other channel.